Welcome again. This is Nature Man Jim, and today we're going to be taking a special orchid adventure. We're visiting the Pink Lady Slipper, also called the Moccasin Flower. Cyperspidium acule is the scientific name. Greek, Greek origins from Cyprus, Venus, and Petilon Slipper, hence the Pink Lady Slipper. It ranges from Newfoundland all the way to South Carolina, and it lives in a special upland woods habitat, usually with conifers, making for a very acidic soil, and it's a very special orchid plant. Its height is up to 15 inches in size, and its leaves are basil leaves, two of them emerging from the base of the stem. They bloom in May, and they have a flower that ranges from pink to a whitish pink. It's a special plant that can't be transplanted, and please don't pick it. It has a fungal relationship in the ground with the genus of fungi called Rhysoctonia. Those Rhysoctonia hyphae, or threads that come out of them, help break the seed coat of the seeds. And when the plants are adult, those hyphae or, or threads from the fungus help to feed the plant, and the plant actually helps feed the fungi too. It has a special method too of bee pollination. Bees come on in, and they get trapped inside the slit of the flower. There's small little hairs on the slit of the flower that contain pollen. And when the bee's trapped inside, it gets a bit little confused. It's pollinating this plant with its pollen, and on its way out, it takes the pollen from the threads or hairs on the slit to pollinate other pink lady slippers. Bees help pollinate the lady slippers from plant to plant. Sometimes the beauty of the pink lady slipper can be a detriment to its health. As it tempts the visitor to pick it or maybe try to transplant it at home. It can't be transplanted at home as when you transplant it, you break the fungal association with the plant and it ends up uh, killing the plant. Take only pictures only when you come to the state park. It's more also a, a micro habitat for insects. The basal leaves form a cup, the flower forms a cup, all for little insects in their little micro habitat here within the parkland. Again, our special orchid adventure here at the New Jersey State Park. Remember, take pictures only and get to a state park today. Enjoy the natural beauty. Thanks again.